top 10 reasons why you should get a Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. Hey all, in this video, you will learn everything about the top 10 reasons why you should get a Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. So make sure you watch till the end. Also, check out the description for more helpful information and if you consider buying a dog. The Cavalier King Charles Spaniel is a sweet-tempered, playful and kind dog that is sometimes referred to as a sporting toy breed due to his mix of Spaniel and toy characteristics. This cuddly breed enjoys snuggling on soft pillows and cuddling in laps, but he also has a more athletic instincts that you might believe. He is a capable runner and chaser, because many cavaliers will chase squirrels, chipmunks, low-flying birds and even butterflies right into the street, a gated yard or leash is required at all times. Cavaliers do require some activity, such as a couple of lengthy daily walks and, most importantly, a fenced yard in which to run. Otherwise, they will gain weight and become sedentary. Moreover, this breed is extremely reliant on human companionship. They require company for the majority of the day and go stressed if left alone for an extended period of time. Cavaliers suffer from a separation anxiety and should be kept company, either human or other pets, for the most of the day. A lonely cavalier will whimper, bark or chew destructively. The majority of cavaliers are friendly to everyone and tranquil around other dogs and animals. Cavalier King Charles Spaniel pups, like any sweet-tempered dogs, have the potential for timidity. Therefore, they need plenty of early socialization to develop a confident, outgoing temperament. Cavaliers are soft-tempered canines who are eager to please, despite their independent tendency. They respond strongly to positive reinforcement as long as you respect them. If you're looking for a dog who with huge expressive eyes and a gorgeous feathered coat in a range of brilliant hues, she's petite, delicate and adorable. Comfort, cuddling on laps and resting on soft pillows are all things she enjoys. But she also has athletic and outdoor tendencies, is calm and courteous to all people, is eager to please and responds well to praise. You might want to consider a Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. If you'd rather not deal with when left alone too long, timidity and timidity in some lines or when not socialized enough, chasing instincts. So he doesn't run on the road in pursuit of a fluttering bird or a butterfly, he requires a gated yard or a leash, brushing and combing on a regular basis. There is a lot of shedding, serious health issues and a life expectancy that could be cut short. You might not be a good fit for a Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. Keep in mind that temperament heredity is less predictable than physical characteristics like size or shedding. Raising and training have an impact on temperament and behavior. Number 10. Beauty. The expression beauty is in the eyes of the beholder is widely used. However, most people will agree that cavaliers are kind of stunning. Their fur is smooth and silky, almost velvet-like. They have hair, but not enough that they need to go to the groomer on a regular basis. For good reason, they're known as the wash and wear dogs. To clean them, all that is required is a large sink or a bathtub. Furthermore, because they do not have an oily coat, most people who are allergic to dogs will have no problems with this breed. This also prevents them from developing the terrible dog smell that most other breeds develop after a bath. There's a reason they're called clean dogs. They're easy to keep clean and aren't particularly fond of filth. Having said that, they're still dogs at the end of the day. Number 9. Intelligence. The Cavaliers have both brains and beauty in spades. They're particularly sensitive to their human companions. It's difficult not to spoil one of today's most intelligent breeds. They're so astute that they're not afraid to take use of their beautiful looks in order to obtain what they desire. We melt just by looking into those enormous, deep, dark eyes. You begin to wonder, what can you get for them? Perhaps a treat? Is it possible to get a belly rub? A pleasant stroll? They've figured us out. With a tiny tilt of the head and a blink of the eye, they can convince us to leap through hoops. I'm not implying that they're overachievers. They aren't. One of the most appealing characteristics is this. They aren't going to demand 50 rounds of ball throw if you return home buckwashed and exhausted. If that's good with you, they'll wag their tail non-stop but just want to snuggle. Number 8. They have a great temperament. When we think about the different aspects of personality, we arrive to temperament. There are many aspects to a person's personality, but the Cavalier has an overwhelming quantity of favorable characteristics. I'll go over a handful of the most prevalent. Please keep in mind that this is not an exhaustive list that each dog may react differently to its surroundings. The Cavalier have a great level of sensitivity and understanding. They will be your constant company if you are sick in bed. They are frequently used as therapy dogs. Compassion for other living things. I have seen them stroll right past several foraging chickens and I don't think they would heard a flea. Mice have been discovered in their mouth on rare occasions but the mice have never been hurt. They weren't giving up the mouse without a fight either. They change their game depending on what or who they're connecting with. 
they're just as content sitting with the kids while they play with the toys as they're hiking up a long twisted mountain trail. Their demeanor makes them the ideal companion and lap warmer, which is exactly what they excel at. Number 7. They have a great attitude. It has the ability to turn a bad situation into a good one or vice versa. This breed, on the other hand, has a laid-back and well-mannered demeanor. That is why, because they are so well-behaved in public, that many people take them with them practically wherever they go. They don't bark or show any symptoms of hostility towards other dogs. That's something they've never experienced before. Aggression. This is what a woman had to say about the dogs. I was sitting at a coffee shop one day, just studying my accompanying dog, when it occurred to me that she was waiting for the people at the next table to come over and greet her. She sat there, wagging her tail and staring them down. And they eventually did come over and introduce themselves to us and her. She was pleased with the result. Patience is a virtue and she demonstrated how much she has on that particular day. Cavaliers are also present oriented which is a beautiful reminder of how much more we need in our daily lives. They don't harbor grudges or dwell in the past. They don't even have dreams for the future. They simply enjoy the moment as it is right now. Number 6. Love The number one trait above and above all of the aforementioned qualities that make them such an exceptional dog is love. They are enamored with everyone and everything. They're sponges for love. They're brimming with love. The list of proverbs is practically endless. This woman said, I've seen them change people who despise dogs into dog lovers. I really have. They've brought smiles on the cheeks of innumerable children as well as a few complimenting licks. It's difficult to completely comprehend until one has experienced the genuine love that they freely give. The most astonishing element is that their supply is limitless. They have enough love to give to everyone who enters their domain. This one characteristic above all others is what distinguishes these spaniels as royal. Number 5. Cavaliers love other animals This is what someone had to say about the pet dog Rio. It's so lovely when we head to a cafe in the morning and Rio wants to say hello to literally every other human, animal or inanimate object that looks real. Sure, it takes a 5 minute walk to extend 5 minutes walking and 15 minutes sniffing, but he's just so friendly. No matter who he wants to say hello to, I know he'll be the same go lucky friendly dog that he always is. Is this the others I have to watch? Number 4. Cavaliers are comforting. Cavaliers are not guard dogs, but they will make you aware of your surroundings and bark if necessary. Cavaliers, on the other hand, are extremely reassuring and caring. Doctors used to prescribe cavaliers to individuals who needed assistance in the past since they are known for being so friendly and caring. Number 3. Cavaliers love to play. An owner of the breed proclaimed the following. I'm not sure if I've ever met a breed that enjoys toys as much as cavaliers do. This small tail wags as a new toy emerges from the bag or this sniff throughout the store for toys you may have brought back. Each toy is played with and adored as though it were their own personal favorite. When we go on a stroll, Rio is fascinated with taking the toys with him. Number 2. Cavaliers are funny. Whatever they're up to, they're always hilarious. Rio was extremely amusing the bulk of the time. Whether he's making a different expression, running around laughing at himself or making me play chase before mucking me. Number 1. Cavaliers love food. You'll never eat alone with a cavalier. Those big glossy eyes will be looking up at you and you'll feel nothing but guilt if you're not giving them the last piece of bacon or a few of your crisps and biscuit. They love their food. So what do you think? Let us know in the comments and share your experience with other interested dog owners.